Before this video starts, I'd like to apologise for how dumb I am in this video. I tried to read the script and I keep messing up and I read it wrong without even realising it so I didn't correct it. So I would read the script and not listen to what I'm saying. Enjoy. Hi guys, my name is Borderlands Game. Welcome to this game called Carp DM. That's probably the worst way you could say that. I don't know how you pronounce that. I'm sorry if I offended anyone. Um, it's a game that's free on Steam and it's like you have one day with this person called AI apparently and it says spend your time wisely Jung, that's me she's late Oh, been stood up I've experienced some problems lately and, we're, we're, and we weren't able to hang out in a while I managed to get things working so I can spend time with her. But it's only temporary and I don't know how long this will last. AI, hey Jung, <gasps> she's here. Well, sorry, did I keep you waiting? You did actually. Yeah, for about half an hour. Oh, a guy is supposed to say, not at all, here, you know. I didn't know that. I wasn't notified about this change in society. They didn't bother because they don't know you're not going to follow it anyway. Oh, she's very angry already. Damn right. So where do you want to go? Let's go, right. Let's go to the arcade. I know a good arcade place. Want to check it out? Sure, I've never been to an arcade before, but I'm interested. I know you are. Really? Don't you like games? Did she say she's not interested? If she, I do, but I usually only play at home. Oh, I think she did, but she's never been... For, never mind, ignore everything I just said. I think you'll like it there. Well, we'll see. We're there! As we walk inside the arcade, our eyes are filled with amazement and excitement. Look at them. Hey Jung, look! She points at a crane game. Ah, oh, the classic. AI has always loved cute things. Is that... Uh, am I saying that right? AI? Or is it like... A, I don't know. I want that big spider plushie. No problem, I will get it. And she finds spiders extremely cute for some reason. Spiders are creepy and weird. What is wrong with you? I try to reach for a coin in my pocket. Wait, let me do it. I want to get it on my own. Oh, she's a strong, independent woman. She pulls out some coins and starts playing. She looks very angry. What happened? The plushie had, has all her attention. Her first try barely touched a thing. She wants... What were you even trying to get? Hush, let me concentrate here. Sorry. She managed to grab it, but still no luck. Ah, it fell. She inserts another coin and tries again. Dot, dot, dot. And again. Dot. Dot, 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 dot. And again. This crane is broken. Of course it's not here. Let me get it for you. I'm not good at crane games myself but I got to show off somehow dot 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 got it thank goodness wow how did you do that easy easy I pray to all the gods I know of okay of course I can't say that it's all in the timing it was a fluke right of course and I immediately stopped when I saw her holding out a coin. I would just keep quiet before she asked me to do it again. I hand her the big plushie and she hugs it tight. There are some racing games over there. Wanna try it? Not very fond of those. I'll just watch you. Okay. I'll just play a couple of rounds. I'm not a big fan of racing games either. I just like their setup in the arcade. They are almost completely enclosed and all the seats 
tilts accordingly to the game. It feels real. It does. Stands behind me and watches as I play. As expected, I lost the first round horribly. <laughs> wow, John, are you even trying? Bystanders don't get a talk. She plays with her plushie as I continue my game. Then again, I lost. Ah, just as I thought, this isn't really my thing. If only they have this kind of setup for a completely different game. <laughs> Chuckles as if to mock me. She's not very nice. I think you'd suck whatever game it is. Is that why you can never win against me? What's going on? It's broken. It's broken. It keeps going back. She points at the fighting game arcades. Why is it going back to it? Come on. Playing these when I was a kid, so prepared to get your butt kicked. Whoa. I accept your challenge, Missy. She looks so angry. Finally, I could game, I can play with her. It's not really a date if I'm the only one having fun, right? Practice game, I don't know the buttons yet. I also have not played this game in a long time. We sit across each other and her voice is all I can hear. Spend the first round trying to figure out what every button does. After trying some combinations, my character accidentally hits her. Not fair, don't hit me yet. Hurry up, I can't wait anymore. Just one sec, how do I... Oh, never mind. Alright, I got it. Come at me anytime, bro. Got it, bro. The, bug the battle begins, and we got so into it that I forgot how many rounds we did. But we are all... We are more or less evenly matched. I win half the time, she wins the other half. More importantly, I get to see a side uh, I rarely see. Star, 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 star! Why did I do that? Strangely enough, it was the side of her I find cute the most. No. Oh, it's going back again. Don't do it again. The buttons are not listening to me. I only see her like this when I play with her at home. Which only happened once or twice before. Ha! I won. Beat that. I'm just trying to keep my laughter in whilst listening to her. We play one round after another. Hey, no fair. I wasn't ready. The more she plays, the better she gets. See, I've beaten you three consecutive times already. Junk, screw this. <laughs> she laughs and stands up to stretch. Hey, Jung, let's go grab something to eat. I was... Hey, Jung, let's go... Oh. I was just, it keeps going back on itself. I was just thinking the same. We go to a small diner near the arcade. What are you getting? She looks at the menu for a bit. An order of beef udon and tempura. I guess I'll get the same. We find a table whilst waiting for our order. And the first thing she asks is, where's my food? <laughs> looks like playing games really is tired A out. AI. I call her AI. What? Is that her name? Patience is a virtue. Patience won't fill me up. I'm very true. Complaining won't either. Oh, sick burn, bro! And then our order arrives. Oh, look, it did. She chomped on her food like there was no tomorrow. I did not take a while for her to finish it. Ah, that was good. Rejuvenated? Definitely. That took all my energy. Well, at least you had fun. Yeah, but we need to pick something less active now. How about the park? I'm cool, I'm cool with it. Here's a good spot to sit. I'm surprised it's a bit chilly despite the sun being directly on top of us. Yeah, nice weather indeed. It's so nice outside and you still like to stay indoors the whole day. Outdoors are nice, but indoors are nicer. <laughs> she giggles a bit. How have you been? How have you been here? 
Same old, same old. I bet you still only... <sighs> so I'm going back. <laughs> I bet you still only eat instant food, don't you? More or less. Come on, Jung. What nutrition can adding hot water give you? It's fine. You're learning how to cook for me anyway. Sure, I'll serve you my speciality dish. Burnt rice balls. Yes, every day. You'll kill me. We haven't seen each other in a long, in so long. I have a lot of things to share and ask. And I don't even know where to start. Are you still living in that torn down apartment? Yeah, but it's a bit better now that they've renovated a few things. I think my greatest worry about this place is the people there. Most of them are, are the old people who live here. They should move to a safer place, especially if they're living alone. One good thing about AI is that she can be talkative. It saves me the trouble of trying to keep the conversation alive. I just ask a question and she'll manage to talk for hours about it. How about work? How's it been? Total mess and probably will continue to be. Our boss gives us impossible tasks and most of us are pretty much fed up with it. Quitted already. A lot of quit already due to that and the rest of them are demo demotivated. Then there's Troy, my co-worker, who would slack off until the last minute. He's such a troublesome guy and makes things harder for us. Sometimes he would even ask our other co-workers to do his part. I listened to her whilst noting how much her expression changed since she mentioning that Troy guy. Oh, we're getting jealous. There's this one time we got in the process all mixed up so bad because of him. Our boss was furious that time. Then Troy, she paused my sentence and stared at me. What? Oh, I see. What is it? You're jealous, aren't you? It's written all over your face, is it? I don't really care. Huh? What are you talking about? Anyway, so what did this Troy guy do? See, the tone of your voice gives it away. Leave me alone already. Come on, admit it. I stare into her and wait for her to finish her laughing. What happened to the job offer you got from the other company? Oh, that. I turned it down. I need to be relocated for that job. I don't really want a new settlement and lifestyle for just a little bit of increased... Is I, I don't really want a new settlement and lifestyle for just a little bit of increase in income. It's not worth it. That's fine. I bet you'll get another job offer soon. Maybe even closer here. Who knows? Door. You miss me that much already? She really enjoys making me admit embarrassing things. Yes, so I can give you burnt rice balls already. <laughs> we continue talking and laughing about random things and totally lost track of the time. Oh. She suddenly stops talking. She keeps doing that. I'll be back. She stands up and walks towards the lady giving away some kind of flyers. Oh. She grabs one, waves it at me as she was walking back. They're having a firework display later, we should see it. Yeah, I know about that, they do that here every year. Let's go then before it gets crowded there. Don't worry, I know a good spot to watch the fireworks. It's less crowded too. It takes a bit of walking to get there, plus to go up the hill. The sun just set when we arrived, so I was starting to so it was starting to get dark. Isn't that beautiful? Good, it's just us here. Ooh. Wow, you're right, this is a good view. Right? We sit on the bench and wait for the show. Not long after, dots of light shoot towards the sky. Slowly fade and boom like a flower of different colours. Do we get to see it? The cheers of the crowd at the foot of the mountain can be heard. AI's face is filled with happiness just watching the fireworks. 
I wish this could last forever, but I'm running out of time. She looks at me with a sad look. Oh, the music just... It's time, isn't it? Almost. Don't worry, it won't be long. It's fine. You really shouldn't bother hanging out with me. Don't say that. After all, I'm just... Dot dot dot. Have you heard of the Turing, Turing test? It's an evaluation of machines' ability to exhibit intelligence, whether it can act or speak like a human. But however, a good machine becomes, however, indistinguishable it is from humans. It will never be an actual human being. Just like AI. No matter how good her program is, and no matter how much I deny it myself, she will never be real. We aren't in the same dimension and reality. So, we'll continue to dwell inside the artificial world that I created. Ah, oh, the program crashed again. That's so sad. As expected, it couldn't go away any longer than that. I really need to come up with a stable fix soon. What am I going to do with my life? Thank you for reading. I would like to thank everyone who supported this first visual novel project of mine. I hope to see you again on my next project. I got really sad at the end. And I reckon I'll play this again another time with a different... See if I can go somewhere else. But For now, thank you for watching this video. If you liked it, leave a like. And I'll catch you all on the flip side.